Okay, so now we're going to have a look at some selection uh, options. Uh, we're going to just look at the basics in this one and then we'll go on to uh, some slightly more advanced uh, options a bit later uh, in the next video. So basic selection, we need to be in edit mode um, to select polygons, edges and vertices. So let's go to edit mode by pressing the tab key and then depending upon which mode you have set up here will depend upon which which item you can select. So we have vertices, edges and faces or polygons and if I just left click on a polygon it will select it. If you want to select more than one polygon uh, you can press shift down and add to your selection by clicking them. And similarly if you're doing it for edges or, uh, or vertices. Now one really helpful uh, aspect of uh, Blender is if I have a polygon selected and actually what I want to do is perform a selection on the edges around this polygon. If I simply go to edge mode it will select them and you'll notice it doesn't look very different um, but it's just saying that you have all four edges of this polygon selected so it's highlighting the polygon to you. So I'll just uh, have a look at that. So if I select one, two, three edges, the polygon isn't highlighted. But if I then select the fourth, the polygon highlights. And you know, I, I was a bit confused by that to the start. I thought, well, I'm in edge mode. Why can I? Why is the polygon selected? Well, it's just an indication that you've got everything selected for that polygon. And then if I go to uh, vertices on that, uh, I now have each vertex selected and the polygon is highlighted and the edges are highlighted because everything is connected and it's all selected. So that's, uh, you know, basic selection. Uh, in the next video, what we're going to do is start to look at um, selecting groups of polygons and loops and multiples and um, yeah so we'll have a look at that in the next video and I'll talk to you then